Om Shanti. Welcome to 14th of October's Godly Blessing. Supreme Father wants us to finish all the limited situations with an unlimited awareness. You see, people who have been visionaries in their life, they have faced situations in their life, they have faced barricades in their life, they have faced roadblocks in their life when they were moving ahead in their life. And they did not look at the limited situation. They looked at the bigger picture, what they wanted to achieve, and they achieved it. They crossed over or they crossed at the sides or they crossed under those situations. How do you do that is what we're going to learn over here. God says, may you be an experienced image who finishes all limited situations by being an embodiment of unlimited awareness. You elevated souls are the trunk who have a close and direct relationship with the seed that is God. So God is talking about the tree of life and he is the seed of that tree and the tree is a human world tree. And the two main leaves, the three murti, the two main leaves are Adam and Eve or Brahma and Saraswati or Jagadamba otherwise or otherwise Shri Narayan and Shri Lakshmi. The three murti also, that is Brahma, Vishnu and Shankar, remain stable in the elevated stage, be embodiments of unlimited awareness that what is happening in the world, creation of the new world through Brahma, that means new knowledge, soul consciousness, destruction of the body conscious world through Shankar, and then sustenance of the new world through the qualities of deitism, which are depicted in the form of Vishnu, two hands of Sri Narayan, two hands of Sri Lakshmi. Both men and women are divine over there. So sustenance of that new world that is heaven on earth through them. So remain stable in this elevated stage. Be embodiments of unlimited awareness. And this is what is happening in the world. And all limited and wasteful situations will finish. You will see a bigger picture. We won't be worried about or concerned about what is happening in the limited situations all around us. Remain in your stage of unlimited maturity. Don't be bothered by or bogged down by small situations. Whether it's financial situations, health situations, relationship situations. So unlimited maturity will come. You know why they are behaving like this. You know what is happening in the world. You know what is the situation of the world. You know what is the atmosphere of souls in the world. You know the sanskars or the habits of the souls. What they are suffering with. We know that. And you will become images that have experienced everything. When with we have this much of experience, we have this much of knowledge, then automatically it is going to be unlimited maturity. Constantly keep your occupation of unlimited maturity in your awareness. The duty of you ancestors is to be immortal lights that means show them the guidance and direction the way to behave and show the destination to the souls who are wandering in the darkness their thoughts their words their behaviors are making them wander in the darkness so god says show them the light by your own thoughts your own words and your own behaviors and that's what we learn in brahma kumaris on a daily basis we try to improve our thoughts words and behaviors so that our world changes around us and what are those thoughts what are those words and what are those behaviors for that, you'll have to come to Brahma Kumari Center and learn the art of soul consciousness as compared to body consciousness. Om Shanti with this.